Today is going to be a quick vlog to just show you guys what we're doing in our greenhouse. You can see that we are fully cropped out in here. It's all opened up and what the plan is here, we are going to purify this greenhouse. The idea is that we want to leave it open and let it freeze hard over the next few weeks. And um, we've covered up these two beds of spinach uh, just to keep them safe from the extreme cold. Uh, mind you, we don't really get extreme cold here, but we'll get kind of cold. I'm, I'm expecting that we'll have some periods of minus 15 degrees Celsius for a little while. The spinach will be fine anyways, but it's just sort of a extra precaution to keep it covered. That way we might be able to harvest some of it throughout the winter. But we have cropped out all of our Salanova in here. Mark just did the last harvest of these two beds just a couple hours ago and he's gone through and pulled it all out because we're not going to get a second cut at this point. It's really, it would be really unlikely. If you guys followed the vlogs last year, you, um, or last winter, you, you would you remember that we had this, we kept this heated throughout the winter and it just wasn't worth the energy in to get that second cut. The second cut took a long time to grow. It was a mediocre harvest at best. It's just not really worth it. It's one of these things where you cut your losses. But what's happened in this greenhouse because it's been um, an, a pretty much a year round greenhouse going on two seasons now is we've got some soil problems in here as far as um, fungus and pests. So that's because it's never had any severe cold to basically purify it. Which is what's great about farming in a cold climate is that each year you get sort of a reset. And so we're trying to mimic that. You know, we've pushed the season pretty far. We're mid-December here now and um, We'll let it freeze out for a few weeks and then maybe in the new year we'll start prepping the beds again and getting them ready for early plantings, maybe late January, something like that, and then have production back going into the, the late winter or early spring. But the idea is to basically just freeze it out and uh, let nature do the work. Hope you guys found that helpful. You want to see more stuff like that, hit the subscribe button. Please like and share the videos with your friends and leave your comments and questions below and I'll make videos about the best comments or questions that I see. Talk to you guys later.